Like, you know, when you kind of visualize something that you want to happen and you dream about it and then it happens and it was everything and more that I could have ever dreamed. And I think the only hard part was that he wanted to stay out longer. If you guys saw, you know, he could have stayed out all day, but it was beautiful and it was um, just very grateful for everybody that made it happen. He's great inspiration. I mean, we look, look at how hard he tries. He's definitely a uh, good role model for us. And that's what we were playing for today. We were playing for Will and uh, he definitely helped us out today. Uh, he's always been like our super fan, and it was just really good to see him get out there, and I think it meant a lot to him. So, well, it's such like a big part of our program, and helped us, helped us win. I think. Uh, what Will has earned that, you know, he's been a big part of this program for the last couple of years, uh, four or five years actually, and uh, he earned that. Uh, we wanted to honor him. He did a great job today. Uh, we all love Will. It it meant a lot, you know. Um, you know, being a part of this team has been a great thing on a uh, great, um, you know, trying to enjoy every moment of it. I might be coming back next year. I'm always, you know, looking forward to, you know, going in my senior year for all the games. Um, you know, I'm just keep on plugging along you know you know he's been involved with the team for uh, the past six or seven years and I think I, I don't know if I told you earlier um, you know it started because he's always loved football since he was teeny and he, he always used to walk around with the football in his hand and he had his little leg braces on I have pictures I'm throwing the ball in the yard and so um, when our good friends the Brooks' son Brendan was playing and they asked why we didn't come to games I said you know Will said it's just too hard for him and Brendan on his own went and initiated um, with the coach to see if Will could come help out and be on the team and sit on the bench and that's how it all started. So for six years he's come and he's gone to the away games, home games, he goes to the team dinners, he has a letter jacket, he goes to the banquets um, and he's remained most importantly connected with the kids that he grew up with because he did go to school here in Wellesley through fifth grade and so um, you know, having him being involved has meant the world, and I think that um, you know today was something that he dreamed about. Although we've always told him because of his cerebral palsy, it's you know not really realistic. It's gonna it could hurt him. It's not safe. Um, but for him to be able to do this today was really just the icing on the cake of a really great story, and we're very grateful to all the people that have made this happen.